Yakima's city council could make some changes to the city's pit bull ban after getting a handful of letters from people saying that they use the breed as service dogs. Laura Murray joins us now with details on what changes could be made and how the city says they're still putting public safety first. Laura. Shane, just to clarify, there is still a pit bull ban inside Yakima city limits, but these changes would make an exception for people that want to use pit bulls as service dogs in association with the American Disabilities Act. The code administration manager says if you decide to use a pit bull as a service animal, you have to meet with the city and get a license even though the fee is waived. You also have to keep a muzzle on the dog when walking it, use a leash no longer than four feet, and keep it in a fully enclosed kennel when the dog is in the backyard. The city says their top priority is public safety. We're just trying to do our due diligence to protect the public from a dog that we do have a ban. And so the public can feel uh, comfortable when they see one of these dogs walking down the street. The pit, bull, the pit bull used as a service dog has to be spayed or neutered and microchipped as well. The city says they're currently meeting with about five to six people who say they want to use pit bulls as their service dogs. The city council will vote on the ordinance during their next city council meeting, which is Tuesday night. Live in Yakima, Laura Murray, NBC, right now.